Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to use hex code to mix colors. Uh, to review, hex code uses six hexadecimal digits to represent colors. Two each for red, green, and blue. Uh, for these three pure colors, red, green, and blue, you can vary the amount of each to create over 16 million other colors. For example, orange is pure red. Wait, for example, orange is pure red mixed with some green and no blue. In hex code, this translates to FFA500. The digit zero is the lowest number in hex code and represents a complete absence of color. The digit F is the highest number in hex code and represents the maximum possible brightness. So we want to replace the color in our style elements with their correct hex code. We've got Dodger blue, we've got green, we've got orange, and we've got red. Um, we want to give the H1 element the I am red color red. So I am red text red. Right now it's black. We want to make it red. So FF000. Boom, it's red. That's great. And uh, we want to use the hex code for the color red instead of the word red. Whereas in here, the, it, would, it would be possible for us to write in um, uh, Dodger blue. And then this would change to ble be blue. But we don't want to do that because we're trying to do it in hex code. This should be with a pound. I'm not surprised that that actually worked. And then it should be pound zero zero FF zero zero. And that should be green. Okay, I did that on the text green. This should have been in blue. So I'm going to copy, I'm going to co paste this out of here, put it in here. And then the green text should be uh, pound FF uh, zero zero FF zero zero. And then the orange text, FFA500. Oh, look, I made Dodger Blue there. Dodger Blue should be 1E90FF. There we go. That doesn't look like Dodger Blue to me. That looks more like Baby Blue. Anyways, this should pass the tests. So basically, oh, the hex code, uh, color orange. Oh, wait, use the hex code for the color orange instead of the word orange. Do we have the word orange in here? Ah, so this is cool. I forgot to put the pound tag in here. I'm inter it's interesting that this actually changed orange, but that's outside the scope of this uh, lecture. So uh, we put the pound key in there and it should work. Okay, so great. What did we basically do in this tutorial? We just changed from the colors, the, the strings, just like the word green, and we put it into hex code. Hex code is going to be more common than anything else that you're going to see. So um, get used to this and uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one and we'll see you in the next lesson.